Today, I stand before you, mothers, fathers, husbands, and wives, with one thing in common. They either needed a kidney, loved someone who needed a kidney, or cared enough about their fellow man to donate a kidney just because they could. We get to see the best side of humanity in transplant, and, and it is, it's awe-inspiring. Some patients had been waiting on the list for five and ten years, had been uh, checked against hundreds of donors, never having one compatible, and uh, all of a sudden, kind of out of the woodwork in a sense. These compatible pairings showed up, and uh, we were able to do this. It's an extraordinary thing. Where she would still be waiting on a list every day on dialysis is one less day alive. We come out to D.C., and she's got a new kidney, and she's doing great. You know, these people heal my wife out here. She's like an angel. <laughs> um, I get a new kidney, and, but I also get a new friend. And, and you know, somebody who uh, hopefully I'll stay connected to yeah. for all my life. So. A tr tremendous, just a tremendous uh, thing. I, I was just telling her now I can get in touch with my feminine side just by putting my hand down here and uh, but uh, the kindness of strangers never underestimate the kindness of strangers for me it's a two for one bonus because my dad gets more life and then he does also and his fam I met his family and so that's is, I can't describe it but anything but a blessing because that's really what it is to me there's no better feeling in the world uh, than giving somebody back their life. You've given someone a life, and um, there's no substitute for that.